I put on my Hylian shield here because I don't want my dick. Deku. <laughs> um, my, my Deku <laughs> shield to burn. Yeah. My dick to burn. What? That's also bad. My dick you I guess that would be a reason, but <laughs> uh, Oh man, I... my little Freudian slips. And you know what's funny? To show the trick, I have to take my Deku shield back out. Oh, uh, look at you, contradicting yourself. You're a contradiction. You're a contradiction. <laughs> <laughs> no, you. <laughs> exactly. Just get ready yelling. Guy's face. <laughs> Tyler has no idea what I'm about to do. He's probably gonna need to be Oh god, I messed up, I messed up, I messed up. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Uh, you screwed up. You're gonna use the explode to get up there. No, not really. Well, sort of, but not not the way you think. No, because it's not the explosion that does that. There we go. Trick successful! Let's rock! <laughs> what? <laughs> Why did that work? <laughs> Trick successful, let's rock! Man. Come on, Tyler, you were here for the ice caverns later. <laughs> yeah, you were. It's been a while. <laughs> okay, anyway, if you take a bomb out, and then you drop it, and then you swing your sword at it while locking on, and then you just keep tapping the A button, Link will put away his sword, and then when the bomb hits you, you'll get knocked away. And then if you try to do a backflip, you'll jump straight up. I don't know why. I don't know why! <laughs> but you do. That's how you do it. So, you know, I broke the, the, the Dundago's Cavern, but I'm not using it because there's things that I need to get here anyway. And I try to use their explosions. But I forgot that you actually have to slash these things to make them explode, so I kind of messed it up. You can also use it with the larger shield. Yeah. You were doing it right, but it doesn't. It didn't happen because of bad luck. Yeah, well, you're supposed to slash them, so... That's the better way. Do you Take some damage, do that? Yeah, you get bombs in this dungeon. Uh oh. <laughs> Spoilers! <laughs> How could you... So, oh, those things. Sorry, I... Even when I... Like, I don't know. If I was playing this for the first time now, I think I would kind of expect that I would get bombs here. Why? Because of bomb flowers. Yeah. But you already have bomb flowers. Why would you need bombs? Because you need bombs everywhere, not just where there's flowers. And it's a Zelda game. That's your well, indication. If I had never played a Zelda game before, I think I'd be a little screwed in that department. Who's but never played a Zelda game? People who don't play games and or Zelda games. I meant a, game, <laughs> I meant a gamer who never played people uh, play Some Zelda people games. who do not particularly like games that are... I am going to <laughs> kick these lizards. Face. Well, bye. Get out of here. <laughs> Dick? I mean, you, I'm sure you saw what I did, but I did the DQ slash thing, so I'm doing the crouch stab to, uh... <laughs> go in. <laughs> I... I'm gonna come fight you. I am... No. I'm such a Spartan. <laughs> it's true, that's the Spartan. Thing. <laughs> Crash into my shield, stab you. Crash into my shield, stab you. <laughs> he's like, come on! Fight me! So that means these guys are Xerxes. <laughs> Hi, oh, lizards! <laughs> yeah, well, you saw the people in the movie 300. They were. They had lizard people. I don't know if they had lizard people exactly. They had, they had that had giant people. guy. Yeah, I know. Like that didn't actually happen ever. Of course, <laughs> it happened. These, Look in your these the Dundagos. They explode when they die. The explosion will hurt you. Yeah, so run away. Also, their fire breath will destroy your Deku shield, but that you really don't have. They're such strange creatures that they, have, they don't have legs I at first. I think, probably with bad memory, but I think if you don't kill them in one hit, when you hit them, they spin around. Yeah, they do a tail spin and then they face you and then they immediately launch into a flame breath, so. They're, they're kind of dangerous. Kind of. Unless you, you know, break the game like I do. And then that's right. I do. It's not a break of the game, it's just tactics at that point. It's, 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 it's kind of weird. breaking the game. Yeah, well, maybe, it, well, it's if using... If you're skipping cycles of enemies, like, attacks through their life total, then you're 
pretty much breaking the game. Yeah, because there's that. <laughs> well, I mean, you could do that anyway by using a Deku stick jump attack, and then it wouldn't matter. But, like, you'd be breaking off sticks. You'd break three. But yes. I would never waste Deku sticks in such a manner. Even though I kind of do on the boss here. But, uh, assuming the crouch stat doesn't really help. <laughs> I didn't say what the boss was, although I'm sure it's difficult to guess what it would be. Well, I don't think you should explain heaven. before you get to the boss the tactics that you use. Or the exact way you do it. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Just saying. I mean, it takes there... out of the, like, what is he gonna do? <laughs> what? What is he gonna do? I don't... Fine, I'll, I'll never explain that. Never. <laughs> Not be I don't believe you. <laughs> I'll try not to. I believe. <laughs> I have faith. Thank you, Tyler. <laughs> and that's the button that I pressed earlier, but, you know, you can skip that entire half of the dungeon if you like. I mean, there's not anything particularly interesting there. There's no map or compass or anything, really. There's a door with a golden skull in it, but... Who needs them? Completionists like me. So much so that I'm uncovering this other little wall. It's just completely pointless. Considering it only has a, a Deku merchant back there who sells you a Deku shield. Just gives you darn ears. There's also a free Deku shield and a chest in this dungeon if you wind up burning yours. And if you already have one, then it only has um, five rupees in it. Like most things. Huh. <laughs> I'll point out the chest because I do open it. But... <laughs> oh man, I remember. I was sort of fancy going up these stairs. What is in the chest for the Free Highland Shield. If you already have a Highland Shield. I would imagine five rupees. <clears throat> Since it's a tiny chest. Oh, this guy. This guy? This yeah. one. Right here! Yep. Those are statues, by the way. This actually works out pretty well, surprisingly. I comboed that guy right in the face. It's, it's weird, I didn't actually plan on it working that well, because it usually doesn't, but... But it did. But it did, so, you know, that's good. Compass, completely useless. It's useful if you want to know which room you came out of, although I don't know how you'd get lost. <laughs> it's that and treasure chests. Uh, but besides that... Here we go. Oh! And honestly, it's usually a lot harder to find compasses yeah, than this to get back to the I was back flipping. Just Are you kidding. upside down? Oh, I thought for a second you were upside down. I was like, oh <laughs> shit. I'm still kind of, not upset, but just like, why did you do that? You could have just... <laughs> you could have avoided the explosions. <laughs> oh yeah. I could have, but... I, I thought I wouldn't get hit by it, because I usually time it better. <laughs> We should just call this a speed run. But I have edits in it, so it can't be particularly time. And it's a lot slower than a lot of the much higher up speed runs. Yeah, I like those people who meet in like five hours. This is longer than five hours by a lot. <laughs> and I switched to my Highland Shield here because I don't want Fire Keys to burn my shield. And most speedrunners skip eight lot of items, and he's doing a speedrun while collecting all of the items. Yeah, well... There should be a hybrid name for that. 100% speedrun. <clears throat> well, I mean, there are people who have gotten, like, all of the heart pieces and stuff, and still done it in, like, six hours. It's heart pieces. <laughs> and Skulltolos. Alright, kick his ass. I don't <laughs> Fine, go to speeddemosarchive.com, download one, and watch it. Unless it was a TAS, I don't know. It wasn't a TAS. It was just done in segments. I mean, single segment things are a lot. I was trying to do it. If it was done in single segments, that doesn't particularly count either. <laughs>
if, if you just mean like they did a section perfectly with just one video clip. Yeah, sometimes they do that, and sometimes they're really long sections instead of short ones. Yeah, that's that's kind of dumb. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm more interested in single segments. Although I do occasionally watch segmented ones just to see, you know, like <clears throat> on things like I don't know, Devil May Cry and Ninja Gaiden. I'm kind of interested in segmented ones. You know what? I probably should explain uh, Transition Bird and exactly when it's used. It's used when it's between two locations, usually too long for a speed up. Um, that's pr a transition between two different areas, and that he doesn't particularly do anything particularly nifty to get from point A to point B. It's a very standard, everyone kind of does it. Yeah. Movement. I'm trying to avoid it. <laughs> but I already had. <laughs> I know, but you're so intentional trying to avoid it. Hi. Hi. What's behind this blood? A recovery heart. Uh, bullshit. Say <laughs> there it was. It's poison. It's, no, it's not. The band poison. That that's especially not true. But what if it was? Then I would be surprised. Mmm, you say that now, but... I don't even know that if that's actually how he's supposed to get up there, but I don't... That's how I do it. I don't... Actually, think wait, I, I think you can use the block. The dark egg probably could, but... I've never nope. done it that way. I've always just done it through the water. <laughs> <laughs> you could probably use the block. I... Why didn't I think of that earlier? The block. Oh my god. The block makes sense. Ah, uh, good timing that time. Yeah, but still, that's just a waste of time. Especially since my first instinct was high place, jump from high place. <laughs> I don't know particularly why I came up here, but... <laughs> don't worry, you'll see it again. Yep, there's a door you can bomb up there. I didn't mean to do that. Make it harder for yourself, just do it. <laughs> yes. Will. I actually push it back. It's not even, but it still needs a gap. <laughs> Why? I. Uh, he wasn't gonna spend the time <laughs> fixing it. I, I would have felt it would have felt weird if I had missed it again. You know what you probably should have done? What? Take the block and pull it back. <laughs> yeah. I I kind of realized that while I was watching it. Oh well. You live and learn. <laughs>